To protect yourself from electric shock, you need an RCD or residual current device. But inside RCD, we have two types, RCCB and RCBO. What is the difference? And what about the older ELCB device you still hear about? Today, I will make it crystal clear in just a few minutes. Consider subscribing in Electrical Engineering Planet channel to support our community. Also, don't forget to share, like, and let knowledge enlighten your world. An RCD compares the current flowing out on the line conductor with the current returning on the neutral. If there is difference called residual current, it means some current is leaking to Earth, possibly through a person or damaged insulation. When that leakage exceeds a small threshold, typically 30 mA for personal protection, the device trips fast, usually in 30 milliseconds, and in other devices under 300 milliseconds. This will cut the power and reduce shock risk. An RCCB or residual current circuit breaker is an RCD that only looks for earth leakage. It doesn't protect against overload or short circuit. That means in a proper installation, you pair it with MCB or miniature circuit breaker. This combination will protect you from earth leakage and overload and short circuit. But for an RCBO or residual current breaker with overcurrent combines the RCD function and the MCB function in a single device. It trips for earth leakage and for overload and for short circuit on the exact device. So RCBO is a combination between MCB and RCCB. ELCB stands for Earth Leakage Circuit Breaker. Historically, people used ELCB for two different devices. Voltage operated ELCB, an older design that trips if it detects a rise in voltage on the earthing system. It depends on the earth pass and can miss some dangerous faults like a live to neutral shock. So these are obsolete in modern standards. Current operated ELCB, which is basically what we know now as RCD, RCCB or RCBO. If you see ELCB on old gear, it's likely the voltage operated type. Replace it with an RCD that meets current standards. In the next video, we will learn how to wire an RCD in a three-phase system. Consider subscribing in Electrical Engineering Planet channel to support our community. Also, don't forget to share, like, and let knowledge enlighten your world. Thanks for watching.